A super special shout out to all my amazing members and patrons for going above and beyond in supporting the channel. If you want to join them, consider becoming a patron. The link as well as the associated perks are in the description down below. Hey everyone and welcome back to Where's UK Mod. So I'm on my way to this trade over here because we're going to be doing these quests. Oh, that's a nighttime restore power. I'm going to go for that treasure map as well so I can just as well stop there or something. Anyways, um, yeah, as you guys know, we have a ton of stuff we want to sell. Um, damn, don't have enough space. Is there anything else I can actually just scrap for now? That's going to be a waste. I think we should probably just quickly stop at the trader, take the cheesecake, and then use that. Be careful because there are some zombies out here. Jump, 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 jump. But yeah, as you guys know, uh, we did... What the hell? The Pentagon, and then later we did that spider's nest behind it. It was super freaking creepy. <laughs> it was way more creepy than I thought it was going to be. Uh, you know what? We can actually go for that other treasure, and then go for that trade over there. Because since that's a nighttime quest, we won't be able to do that now. So if we go for this treasure over here, go sell the stuff at that trader, and then go for this one over here, it's going to help us way more. But yeah, that spider's nest, I mean, I know a spider's nest is a spider's nest now. <laughs> But I didn't think it was actually going to mean like an actual literal spider. For those of you guys that have arachnophobia and you didn't watch last episode, I recommend you skip like half the episode. Because that was just creepy as hell. The small ones are basically face huggers and the big ones are just gigantic, massive eight foot spiders. So you have to be super, super careful when you face them. Okay, so I just found the treasure, but I had to come and drop some stuff off. That's going to be a problem. Um... Yeah, that die wolf's too fast and he's gonna set us a light. What if I can't uh, shoot at him and have him fall in the pit here with me and then it's gonna be easier to kill him? Because if he actually gets too close to us right now, he's definitely gonna uh, he set us a light. Nope. Okay, 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 okay. So most of this we'll be able to sell. I didn't bring any other mods with, did I? These, yeah, I don't have any uh, more melee mods, unfortunately. Okay, so let's go. My senses have picked up I have to go something. to this trader. <laughs> Woo! Okay, so I was a little bit worried for nothing, it seems. I am a gunslinger. <laughs> but yeah, zombie dogs are a little bit faster, but these die wolves are new to Alpha 21. I can't remember there being the radiated or the, the radiated and fire... Hounds, uh, wolves. I know that they used to be normal dogs, but I don't know about the wolves. Ultra over there, at least my HP seems to be good. I need to be careful because I think some of these guys have started respawning at the traders. Oh, giant demo. Hello, my friend. It's been a while. Oh. We actually still have uh, quite a few uh, resources over here that I didn't loot. Damn. I could have sworn I looted all of the traders, everything, but it seems I didn't. Okay, so before we sell stuff, I want to make sure there's nothing we have to hand in over here. Okay, so we are going to take some cheesecake. We're going to sort our inventory, and then we have to sell from right to left. So if you sell over here, you have to do this. Because when it sorts the stuff over here, it usually puts whatever is on the, the like, mostly, look at that, the best quality on the right side. Uh, doesn't want that. This is going to give us 10,000 just for that stack. And that's just basically from the Pentagon. Much obliged, or at least stranger. that's the HD ones from the Pentagon. We're still selling the normal ones. Okay, just do that. And let's do this again. The nice thing is because there's five of this, dude. I'm just hoping they don't share the inventory. Otherwise, I won't be able to sell everything. But with this, we'll be able to buy all of the glue and duct tape and steel and stuff we want from our vending machines. Technically, I first want to see, does he perhaps have something that we want? Because basically, if he does, I'll be able to buy it here for cheaper now that we have the other stuff drank. So steel, for example, yep. Uh, cobble, why not? I don't think I need any of the other stuff over here. We have way too much of the other resources. Yeah, that one's not done. Do that, do that, do that. And I think, do that. Okay, come on, I need more steel. We have a ton of forged iron, it's just the steel that we really need right now. 60 steel just to be able to make myself a new drone. I thank you, kind sir. I thank you too, kind sir. I've got the best deals in Navis gain. Steel 5, glue. 
steel glue duct there, basically. The rest of the cash I'll just spend at the base. Oh, I have to check for food. Duct tape, nice. No steel over here. Um, I have to check for food because we need those lamb rations. Can you buy them over here? But I could have sworn you could interact with both of these vending machines. But we need one more lamb ration for the one class we're busy with right now. The cook class. And I'm hoping that we're actually basically almost done with it as well. Large beef ration, that's not what we want. Cook class, burgers, meat. Okay, we need to make a fax fox. Let's see, fax fox. Fax fox burger. Uh, yeah, normal lamb rations is all we need right now. Technically, I could go by all the traders because all of them have vending machines. But I think while we're looting now, we just have to make sure we take cabinets as well. So we'll go for this tier 4 infested, uh, infested, <laughs> infestation over there and we're going to use normal shotgun rounds as well. Unfortunately, my shotgun's very close to breaking. So the moment it breaks, we have to go back to the base, unfortunately. Nice. 66,000 coin just from a small visit. Damn. Uh, there's no iron giving stuff over here, right? There's stone and cobble and sand and stuff, but there's no iron. Although I think you can, yeah, you can loot these. I put a little bit of iron. That's not worth it. Okay, demo over there. We have to be careful of him. Let's go back into town. And now we can actually have some fun. <laughs> oh, hello. I to be careful that that dude doesn't all of a sudden see me and run. These demos are insanely fast. You have to be super, super careful. They're basically faster than the dogs and stuff. They're like titans that can sprint. Because even during Horde Night, I don't really see the titans moving super, super fast. Okay, I'm hoping they don't just have meat from the big piggies over here, but also have some proper foods. I mean, what a place to actually <laughs> clear out now that we need food. Oh, hello. I was wondering why I heard the noise from this. I know this place is infested, but I didn't realize it's the infestation that I'm hearing. Should probably close this door behind me. I don't want to worry constantly about stuff coming from behind. And then, yeah, we have to uh, loot every single cabinet just now and hopefully get some more vending machines too. I need that food, man. I need it. I need ya, and I want ya. Oh, okay. Nope, nope, nope. Since this isn't infested, you'd think there'd be actually a ton of zombies in the roof and stuff. There's a final stash. Oh, where did you come from? Yep, see, roof. Oh, it's actually really bad for me to be inside of here. Since it's infested, if this whole place wakes up like they did at the... Oh, two different things. If this whole place wakes up like they did when we did that uh, Pentagon... Oh, man. For those of you guys that didn't see it, it was Monday's episode. There were so many zombies that lagged the game. Let me just do that. Do this. Do that in case they fall through the roof and do this. Okay, I'm probably going to have to open that up. Wait, what? Man, I love this weapon. Okay, I'm not going to get any resources anymore because for now, basically, we have all the concrete and all the cobble we want. It's just stuff like this that we have to loot. Because we need like duct tape and glue. Although with 66,000, we don't really need those things anymore. Hello, never knew there was something up here. But yeah, now that we have 66,000 cash, we can just go from our vending machines and buy over there. Oh, I thought there was a double just now. That was a waste. There might have been something inside, uh, something good inside there. Unfortunately, I still can't one-shot these. I think if I had a red impact driver with some more mods in them, I might have been able to do more damage. Hello. Radiated piggy. Wait, what? Gonna make it through here. This does not feel infested. I'm sorry. I feel like the infested is supposed to be way harder than this. Although I need to be careful. Oh yeah, there is a small pup over here that wasn't part of this place. 
When I drove past here, I saw him. Okay, at least the roof's waking up. Less job, uh, less work for me. That pig is still awake. Yep, 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 yep. Kind of well. It's sleeping. Wait, what? Did I just incinerate that dude? Man, this weapon is powerful. Okay, so locked over there. What's over here? Oopsie, knew it. Are oh, you just. Oh. First shot gave me the bird flu. After everything we survived last time, now I get the bird flu. I mean, we have the cure anyway, so it's not too bad, but damn. Wait, what? I know that button's supposed to open it. That was weird, man. That was really weird. That button is supposed to open a locked door. That door was not un uh, that was unlocked. That's the whole reason I actually first clicked it and then tried to use the button. Okay, no lamb rations, it seems, unfortunately. But... Hello, Mama. Mama Sita. I'm guessing the piggy just woke up as well. Although, I just killed a grace. How much bigger a grace could there be? Do not like you. Woo! Okay, I'm guessing that was Grace. Oh, I just destroyed her. Stand up, man. Stand up. I still love this stuff, baby. Okay, so we came from over there. Grace might still be alive. I'm just gonna make noise. Rick's on the headlock. Well, I mean, I, we killed this dude and nothing woke up on this side. So I'm guessing Grace is already dead. This was supposed to be an infected, but this really didn't feel like one. I'm just getting these because we're gonna need like uh, springs and stuff later. Although I, I'm feeling like at this stage we really don't need it anymore. I was about to say, where's the other scroll? I see it on the map. I think from now on I'll just loot these. We have so much at the base already. I, I don't feel like it's going to be that big a difference. If I don't go and uh, just strip everything every time. Also, we're still looking for those um, wiring 101 and the other stuff. Uh, the knuckle books. So hopefully we can find them soon. Let's see, this one is... Yep, wiring 101. We need like 15 or something of this one and 10 of the other one or something. And final stash. Almost forgot about you. I have to be careful now because this bird flu, I think, affects your brain. Nope. Okay, what does it affect? Fortitude. Okay, that's, that's okay. As long as I get my double reward store. I think the brain virus affects that one, unfortunately. Damn, that's loud. That's the only reason you might want to destroy those because they make so much noise. Okay, it does, it does say return to trader, right? So it means we're done with this one. We'll go for the next one over there, tier 4 clear. Ooh, there's a phantasm over there. My senses have picked up something. Ooh, wait, was there a wandering water be or something? Because this one is over here and this electric one is over here. That makes me think there was a... Oopsie. Oh, okay, because I hit him just now, this dude got electrified. But yeah, usually when there's a wandering horde or something, there's this many running around. You, yeah, you go after the bunny. Just forget about me. Judy Witch. There's definitely going to be pumpkins and stuff over there, but I don't know about food. Oh, the coroner's place. Okay, um... Where do we have to go after this? Straight down the road. So I could just well just park straight here. Then be as oh the stutter. There's a lot of stuff spawning over here now. I need to go into kitchens because we need that lamb uh, lamb rations. Okay, so what I think I'm gonna try and do is just basically just dump stuff every now and then. We have all the coin we have on us. Thank you.
The amount of stutter we're getting right now is really bad. It's a tier 4 clear, but with a stutter just now, it means we just got a ton of spawn. That or there's a wandering horde coming through. I saw a fire or something to the right, so I have to be careful of that. And there's supposed to be vultures over here as well. This time around, there's no vultures, which kind of baffles me. Should probably just take care of this. Because if I don't do that now, uh, they're going to interfere later. Hello. This is a clear area's quest, so she was definitely not part of it because there's no red skull for it. Usually there's a dog or something over here. That's weird. There's definitely a red skull awake somewhere, and there's definitely something spawning in, like a lot of some things. This stutter is usually, like I said, really, really bad news. Yo, what's going to spawn in over here? Just you. That skull looks like it's getting bigger. I'm not going to go for those. I'll loot these. Hopefully it doesn't look too stuttery for you guys. Sometimes even though the game is smooth, uh, the recording stutters. But now there's actually like a ton of stutter in the game. Who knows? Perhaps they even each other out. The drone almost looked like a red skull just now. Turn around, close this door just in case. I have to go for all the trash just in case we get some more lockpicks or glue or stuff. We definitely, definitely need all the glue we can find. Glue and duct tape. Look, we could easily buy it with the 60k we have. But you don't want to waste your cash, you want to save it. Hello? Why is no one feral anymore? What the hell? This is supposed to be a tier 4. I know it's not an infested, but it is supposed to be a tier 4. Can I help you? Okay, now that red skull is at least gone. I was constantly getting uh, worried about when that's going to show up. Okay, we still also need a water source. I need to remember to actually fill up at this pool quickly afterwards. Or there is a pool across the road and across the road from over there. So when we go for this, we need to quickly access that pool and just fill up our jars. I don't think... Oh, please tell me I actually have the jars on me and I didn't drop them at the base. We have like 90 jars that want to fill up so we can actually make our own glue and stuff again. I also hear a ton of gunfire outside, so we have to be careful. Of um, raiders and stuff making it in here. Even if the doors are closed, if they're not locked, uh, the raiders can and will make it in. They're quite clever, those guys. All of a sudden, this sound is playing again. Last time, I wanted to show you guys the sound they made because they used to make this weird... Carol Baskin's thingy. Um, but yeah, they didn't make any noise there. Now all of a sudden they're making noise again. Hello, bookcase. Every time we come across a kitchen, we have to loot the kitchen. Wait, which way do we go? Whoa, you are stuttering like crazy. What the hell? Did you see her? Did you see that just now? She almost looked like an apparition or a ghost or something. She was glitching all over the place. Who knows? Perhaps the game is just lagging or bugging that much right now. This is a wandering horde. Why do you have so many footsteps? Yep, wandering horde. My 
you just drop some food? I should probably just melee them as well. Some of these guys are feral and they're tough and stuff, but if I melee them, I don't have to worry about breaking this gun. As soon as I get back to the base, I'm going to have to make repair kits for this weapon. This is one of my favorite POIs next door over here. In Rebirth, there's actually bandits living inside that POI. They didn't loot, drop any loot bags over here, right? Okie dokie. Uh, first, take care of this dude. Rabbit. Okay, that dude's far away, so let's go. They go all the way around. Hello, hello, hello. Whoa, she dodged that like the Matrix. We'll make sure every time we uh, come into a room, we close the door behind us. We don't want to get surprises later. And then every now and then, we have to make sure we grab all the bones. Oops. Especially since we know we're so low on bones, we have to grab these corpses. Since when's there been two boxes up here? I saw this the other day on another server as well. And it's supposed to only be one box as far as I'm aware. You have to be careful because now the final room is exposed. Come on, man, I need my lamb. If I see any food boxes now, I'm definitely going for it. I should have gone for more food boxes because every time I saw one, I was like, nah, we don't need any food. And now I actually need a lamb ration. I think we only need one lamb ration, but we could need more after that quest. Because at the moment, this is for one of the tiers. After we do this one, there's going to be another one over here that we have to complete. So if we need more lamb rations, we're screwed. Okay, I think those two that we just killed came from over here. Okay, moment of truth. It's just a clear quest, so there shouldn't be anything back here. Sometimes if it's not a clear, if it's a fetch as well, you have to fetch it back at the back of here. Either here or it's behind over there. Hello? Wait, that's open, which means that zombie already came for us. I'm hoping the zombie didn't despawn and respawn behind us. When I make all the noise, I'm going to have to come over here. We don't really need fuel at the moment, and if we even need it, we can just make our own. So even if they destroy those barrels over there, that's fine. Heck, I can even set those barrels off. <gasps> oh, you know what I'm going to do? I don't know if I'll have enough time. If I can shoot with this... Let's quickly grab this. If I can shoot with this and then uh, place a timer on this. Um. Master, we are not alone. Grab not enough time. Oh no, 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 no. That did not work. Woo, that did not work. That did not work. Now my drone's in the way. Damn it. If my drone wasn't floating in the way the first time, I wouldn't have been able to place it faster. Oh, I wish sure this is a tier 4 though. I feel like a tier 4 is supposed to be like more ferals and stuff. Like this dude. Hello? Oh, hello. I'm not joining you in there. No, thank you. Especially since she's a stripper that can give us another infection. We already have the bird flu. I'm just going to grab the bones and stuff over here and then we can go for the final room. Okay, so I hope they don't destroy those boxes. I had to take the ammo file just now just to be able to do this. Come on, man. I just need the brawling book. Wait, what? Four would have been overkill, but three was too little. Okay, so now if we want to make knuckles, knuckles, dun dun, we are still eight, no, not eight, still ten books short. What the hell? I need to see if I can't find myself a bookstore somewhere, like an actual Alpha 19 bookstore, not the Alpha 21 or Alpha 21 crap one, an actual Alpha 19 one. For those of you who don't know, Alpha 19 bookstore had so many more books. It actually had bookcases you can loot and then it respawns later. 
Although on Darkest Falls, I found a um, Alpha 19 bookstore and it had Alpha 19. No, yeah, Alpha 19 bookstore, like a normal one, not the factory. And it actually had Alpha 20 uh, bookcases. I've got that a just bad messed up. About this. Is that a. Yeah, that's just a pig over there. Where am I supposed to be? At the back of here. Yeah. Oh, that's a demo. That is a radiated demo. Um. Look, I quickly want to get the water over here. Is the water on this side or the other side? Over here. Hello? Please fill up. Wait, can't you? Can you not fill it up like this? I thought since it's empty jars, you might be able to fill up, but I'm right clicking, I'm left clicking, it's not working. So it seems you have to go dig up snow to be able to use these in this mod. That sucks. Okay, now the problem is our gun is busy breaking and we have to go kill that demo. The demo's in the way of us doing this quest. So while he's that side... Woo! I have to do this constantly. Just jump back and forth. Hello, my demo, my pal, my friend. Okay, I should be able to start this quest now, right? Need to be careful. Almost forgot that I have this infection, so it slows you down considerably. Okay, I'm gonna close that door. Master, we are not alone. Come on, I just need a lamb ration right now. I'm still gonna loot it as fast as I can and then check my inventory. Just in case there's some ferals back there. Technically, I need to wrench these beds for some nail, uh, for some springs. I am soon gonna have to switch to my... ...stun baton and then we'll have a problem. Because we don't know where all the toughest zombies are. This might still be the super easy zombies. And when I have to kill the tough zombies, all of a sudden I won't have a weapon to do it. This POI looks familiar, but it's too small. Drone, I swear, get out of my bloody way. Let me start doing this. Naughty boy. Naughty, naughty boy. I might need to restart the game after this episode quickly, just to make sure there's less lag. Just in case. Sometimes there are fake walls and stuff. This gun is so close to breaking right now. Um. Hello? There's a fire piggy over there. I've got a bad feeling about this. That burn dude's gonna be a problem if I don't take him down now. Where is you? Okay, hello. Oh, wow. <laughs> I'm trying to loot it and trying to loot it, but I just can't reach it. Then I realize, oh, yeah, can't. You cannot. Please, kitchen has to have some lamb chops. Lamb rations. All I have to do is go hand in all of these quests that we have at the moment. Because if we go to all the traders, one of them has to have some lamb rations. The problem is, then we're going to have to hand in these quests and get new ones. And I first want to finish all of the old ones. Isn't there still like a garage or something we have to clear? It's a final room. I think there's a garage that, or something that I missed just now. And we are encumbered. Okay, so I need to save a ton of stuff as well. You never know what you're going to need later. Read that, eat that. Put a ton of stuff on you. That's why I have it in the first place. I still need to go make that level 6 drone. And I should probably get the final stash while I'm here. If I'm not mistaken, this container takes two shots. Nope. I mean, if it works, it works. Let's see. 
Okay, it worked. I keep forgetting that I have like 200... Oh, wow. I have 232 lockpicks on me, but I'm not using any of them. Uh, almost used that just now. Why, Jean? Why? I almost forgot that I already opened it up. Incoming enemies. Prepare for conflict. Okay. Is there anything else up here? Some resources. Oh, hello, pills. Come on. It's a shame there's no button in here to open up with. I wonder if there's any other vending machines that we can access for that lamb ration. I think that's the only way we're going uh, to get it right now. Unfortunately, so far, we've been super unlucky. Okay, we have two more quests to do, and then we can go hand everything in. Awesome. Although it does feel like we're a little bit short on quests at the moment. Are these really all the quests we have? I could have sworn we had more. Although, yeah, yeah, we were busy with quests before the Horde Knight. We had to stop with our questing for Horde Knight. See, there's a cracker book over there. That's an Alpha 21. I know it's Alpha 21 for those of you wondering. Um, but yeah, I say Alpha 20 because that's when they released that one. The sucky one. Yeah, I need to check over here for more books. If I can get the battery bank book done, we can actually get that quest at least done. Papa Hugh. Please rest, Papa. If I can get... Yes, wiring. There you go. Wiring 101. Nice. Come on, keep giving me wiring. Yes, wiring. Thank you. Oh, okay. That was almost. So. Battery bank. Wait, something battery is already unlocked. Electrician. We are 10 books away from being able to make this one. And for the knuckles, we are 10 books away as well. It feels like it's going to take forever. We need those books. The only problem is with the Alpha 20 uh, bookstore, there's almost no books inside. So there's no even there's no point in even going to check. Ooh, vending machine. Please tell me you sell food, not just drinks. Although I think it's, yeah, it's a, it's a drink machine, so... Put my hopes up over there. Why is there so much lag in this biome? The frame rate right now is like 50, 45. But it feels like it's like 10 frames per second or less. Ooh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Newsstand, hello. I've got a bad feeling about this. I'm definitely not going to do the two bit tower one. For those of you wondering, the two bit tower is a tower that's like split in half. That's one of the worst POIs to clear because you get so disorientated. It's easy when you have to go like with the floors upright, but when the buildings on the side and the floors on the left and right, it makes it so much harder navigating inside. Construction site. I don't need any of the resources anymore, so that's okay. Any of the books that I still need to read? Okay, there's a spider over there. I think the spider might have seen me just now. But I saw a book just now that... Oh, there you go. Boom. Okay, so we have to start this quest over here. I think I'll do this next episode. I wonder if I shouldn't just quickly really restart at least because the stutter... Although I think it's stuttering because we're in the middle of the town. So as soon as we've done with these two quests over here and we return back to the traders, we shouldn't get this lag anymore. Next episode, I want to do these two. I want to do that tier one and the treasure and then we want, I need to go and hand all of this in. But yeah, if you guys like this episode, please like and share with your friends, comments, tips, and feedback. Leave that down below. And if you guys are new to this channel, please remember to hit the subscribe button for more of this content. See you guys next time for some more Where's UK Insanity. Members and patrons get shoutouts in all of my videos, get access to a private members-only Discord channel, and as a thank you for supporting the channel, get access to my Seminace that I server. If interested, check out the links in the description down below.